Howdy folks, it's General Heat here. How's everyone doing today? So, for today's video, it's going to be a bit of a shorter video today, but hopefully you guys will find this to be interesting still. So, what we'll be showing you guys today is, indeed, a little secret hidden toilet on the main menu of Halo Reach. Yes, somewhere deep in the main menu, so to speak, is a random toilet. So before we get into that, I just want to give you a little bit of background to how the main menu of Halo Reach works. So in previous Halo games like Halo 2, 3, and ODST, the main menu was essentially, like in the background, it's a whole actual map. Like 3D and everything, terrain, all that. But in Halo Reach, it's actually different. What you see, it may look like a 3D image in some cases, but the background of Halo Reach is just a bunch of 2D images layered on top of each other. And each layer might be moving at different speeds. So in this case here, you see like the clouds, looks like they're moving. The clouds are actually just another image, a 2D image that's on a lower layer. And they are moving at a different direction or a different speed to give you the illusion that it's like a 3D image with um, the clouds moving in the background. So that is how the main menu works. And that applies to every uh, scene you see on the main menu. It's not 3D like it was in the previous games. Now, we're going to be focusing on the, the scene in the theater lobby on the main menu. So, more specifically, see a little room to the right there that the camera is now panning off of? We're going to be focusing on that room specifically. But you can see, like, it looks like the room is kind of moving or that the, the camera angle is changing. And that is because the room itself or on the inside is another separate 2D image. And the door is actually another image later on top of it. But this is a close-up image of the room that we'll be looking at. So like I said, what you see inside the room, it is not a 3D image, but it is a, um, a different layer. So unfortunately, there's actually something blocking most of the room. <laughs> the room inside, it has a much bigger image to it, um, but the door and actually the walls are blocking quite a lot. But if we could just remove that door, we could see what's behind it. So going into the game files, uh, my friend Jangus actually showed me this and pointed out <laughs> this to me. But if you look in the game files, you can actually get each 2D layer by itself as a separate image. They're all stored as separate images. Uh, and the room image, this is what it looks like. And if you look in the left corner there, you can see the random toilet there in the middle of this living room. Now, <laughs> it's... I don't know why the toilet is there. I would imagine most houses don't keep their toilet in the middle of the living room, but you can see right there, that is indeed the toilet. It's hidden in that little corner of this living room, but you can't normally see it because the door of this building is blocking it. So I guess whoever like designed the room or made the art for the room uh, thought it'd be funny to throw a random toilet there because normally most people would never be able to see it because that door is there and you would never be able to pan the camera any way that you'll be able to see um, the little toilet in the room. So I guess you could call it an Easter egg um, because it's kind of hidden there and nobody would ever see it and it is it is a random toilet there in the middle of someone's living room <laughs> near the fireplace. I don't, like I said, I don't think most houses have a toilet in their living room. I could be wrong though and if you happen to have a toilet in your living room then feel free to correct me but uh, as far as I know that's you know, usually toilets are in separate rooms known as restrooms or bathrooms. But yeah, so there you guys have it. Hidden in, in the theater lobby in the background, in that little room there behind the door with a separate layer is a little hidden toilet. But yeah, so like I said, it was a shorter video today, but hopefully you guys did enjoy it nonetheless. And if you did enjoy it and found it to be interesting, make sure to leave a like as always. Uh, if there's anything else you want to check out or look into or test out or compare, stuff like that. As always, just let me know in the comments, and I'll do my best to look into it when I get a chance. But other than that, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe, and I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.